Young Visionaries Youth Leadership Academy is an award-winning nonprofit organization proudly serving the youth of San Bernardino County since 2001. I think that God gave me um, Young Visionaries and Young Visionaries actually came from um, the Bible who says our old men will have dreams and our young men will have visions. So that's where we got Young Visionaries. Young Visionaries was founded by Terrence Stone, an ex-gang member who has turned his life around and dedicated it to God and the recovery of youth innocence. Being in gangs and, you know, running the streets with, with weapons and, you know, and doing all kinds of stuff to making sure that these kids can stay out of the street and still be successful. I went back to school to be a counselor. I said, well, maybe I can go back and, and help these kids. The organization's purpose is to help enrich the lives of young people through life building activities and instruction in the areas of education, employment, health, mentoring, and community service. We started off with one program. I started off just doing gang intervention. And I started off doing that because that's all I knew. We started developing and learn how to put together effective programs for young people. Everything from youth shelters to youth employment development programs. It's not like a traditional shelter would be. Traditional shelter, everybody up by five, everybody back by to eat dinner by whatever. Uh, there's a lot more flexibility. It's a lot more like a home here. And that's what they need because if you don't, if you've never experienced what a home environment is like, you won't be able to teach it, and you won't be able to portray it and when you go back home. You know, they seen me, and they seen what I have, so they're like, okay, you know, I want to help you. So I'm finally like, people seeing me, and I'm moving forward. We have a music studio where kids can go in there and they can actually make music and music videos and things like that. Show them that they have a voice, you know, in front or behind, you know, the camera, the mic, the engineering. Uh, to go forward and step up to be a leader. To be sure that our kids are being exposed to using the left side of their brain and the right side of their brain. One of the programs, uh, Pistols to Pencils, which was um, in a program to basically redirect the energy and interest of kids away from pistols and gang life and that you know, periphery of um, the drug culture into using their creative talent uh, in uh, spoken word, poetry, drawing, painting. That's what it's all about, is a transformation that we get a chance and the opportunity to work with these young people. We have a program called the Phoenix Life Skills Curriculum for Kids. So, um, so it goes through everything, everything to managing a checkbook, to buying a car, to you know, renting an apartment, your hygiene. You know, it's like just 52 weeks of life skills for young people. I learned how to like deal with my inner problems and not to let it overcome what I'm going through. So they teach us about, you know, picking the right people in your circle, you know what I mean? Don't let people influence you. You have to influence them to do good, you know what I mean? Don't let anybody peer pressure you into doing something that you don't want to do. We developed this youth employment development program, which, which is a hands-on job learning experience for young people. This is our print center location. So when they come here, it's just like they're working at a, a normal job. So it's just not like getting them in a classroom saying, this is how you fill out a resume, this is how you do a job application, but this is how you act, work, and feel in a work environment. Jobs look at, um, you know, education. They want people who got a diploma, people with clean records, people, you know, who want to do things in life. And I always tell them, you know, if you guys need help with resumes, the computer is here, you guys can come back, we'll help you. Because kids, you know, sometimes they still need help and we're here, you know, our doors are open for them to, to get that help so they can get that job, get on their feet, get independent and have something positive in their life. It's something that's really needed in our community for a young person to be able to develop a skill and um, hopefully be able to use that skill to take care of themselves and provide for their families. As young visionaries expand, we always expand with the population that we work with in mind, which is the kids. I chose my friend wiser. I learned, you know, who's for me and who's against me, you know what I mean? So that's something you have to learn. It's just always about development of new skills and habits for young people. I think people thrive when they're acknowledged and affirmed of um, their abilities and who they are as people. I graduated with honors 4.0. Yeah, and before, like, I was a dropout. Yeah, maybe something happened before you got here, but let's look at where you're going now, not where you were, 
but where are you going to go now? Because of organizations and individuals like Terrence and Young Visionaries, um, he has given a lot of young people uh, and a lot of, a lot of Americans in, the, in this area hope. You can do whatever you want to do with your life, you know, you just have to, you know, just buckle down and just do it and make it happen.